my dear students welcome to unit 4 week 11 in your individuals and societies course for grade 8 remember that this week is going to extend from the 19th of may till the 23rd of may let's start with our first week this our first lesson in this week we are going to start with your formative part one you're going to investigate to investigate a specific topic related to culture our word wall is going to include cultural genre investigation examples diversity representation analysis interpretation significance context tradition innovation identify expression stereotypes and subculture going to watch a video about cultural genres and then you're going to have an interactive activity this interactive activity is going to be your formative test you're going to uh, make a research or you're going to write a research about uh, group one is going to research about cultural diversity in your community explore the different cultural groups present in your community their traditions languages and customs group two is going to search about traditional festivals around the world research and compare traditional festival festivals celebrated in different countries focusing on their significance rituals and how they reflect cultural val values traditional clothing explore the traditional clothing of different cultures including its history significance and how it reflects cultural identity Group four is going to research about folklore and mythology. You're going to research the myths, legends, and folklore of different cultures, examining common themes, character, and moral lessons. Group five is going to research about cultural artifacts and symbols. You're going to investigate the significance of cultural artifacts and symbols, such as flags, monuments, and religious symbols in different cultures. Group six are going to investigate about cultural heritage sites, research UNESCO World Heritage Sites or other culturally significant locations around the world, exploring their history, significance and preservation efforts. Group seven are going to uh, investigate about cultural celebrations and ceremonies. They're going to explore the significance of cultural celebrations and ceremonies, such as weddings, coming of age rituals and religious ceremonies in different cultures. You're going to have another video about cultural genres, an interactive activity, further practice, and challenging questions, uh, a self-assessment, and for what to do tomorrow, I would like you to revise and proofread your research paper. For lesson two, you're going to continue working on your informative. Um, you're going to investigate a specific topic related to culture. Again, our word wall is going to include cultural genre, investigation, examples, and so on. You're going to watch a video about cultural dances, an interactive activity about food and culture, interactive activity related to that, further practice, a challenging question, a self-assessment, and for what to do tomorrow, now you're going to start to prepare for your presentation. Remember that the criteria included in your summative um, uh, are criterion uh, B, uh, C, and D. Now we're going for your formative presentation. You are going, at the end of this lesson, you need to be able to deliver engaging and impactful presentation across various settings and audiences. Our word wall is going to include deliver, engaging, impactful presentation and criteria. You're going to have rubrics that are going to guide you on how to present your presentation and how your mark is going to be uh, calculated. You're going to watch a video about how to de deliver an engaging and impactful presentation. Uh, for the interactive activity, I liked uh, to share with you Prizi to start crafting your presentation as an exchange of using PowerPoints. After that, another tutorial about mastering your presentation, an interactive activity again, further practice. Here, the challenging question is going to be a link where you're going to answer challenging questions, a self-assessment related to the topic, and for what to do tomorrow, I would like you to have another interactive activity uh, by clicking on what's next uh, picture. I can't wait to start this fruitful week with you guys. All the love and respect. Peace out.